for that. It's not, it's not a motivating thing. It's winning it. That's motivational to me. It's not all the hoopla that comes before, you know, uh, winning it. That doesn't drive me at all. So to the victor goes a spoil didn't necessarily... Spoils of what? Everybody kissing your butt and telling you how great you are? Yes, exactly. <laughs> For what? I don't, I don't need that. The will the result of a Laker Miami game mean anything to the big picture of the season? No. <laughs> Not for either one. I mean, it's. We've gotten rocked on Christmas Day and won a championship. We've done the rocking on Christmas Day and won a championship. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter one way or another. It's all about how you improve as a season. Did it surprise you when they struggled there for that stretch? Uh, it didn't surprise me. And, um, you know, at the same time, I didn't have any expectations. Uh, what do we want to be coming out the gate? I, I think they're going to be fantastic. I think they're going to do great. You have clearly become a historian that you've gotten, I won't say older, but a little bit along in vet veteran in years. Do you find yourself looking at the other players on that championship list? And obviously, everybody's going to start talking the closer we get to spring about you and Michael in the sixth championship. Do you take any pleasure in looking at that? Do you look ahead? No, I'm, I'm a historian, but I, I'm a historian for, for, for different reasons. Like, I love watching older players and, you know, how they play and the different teams and how they gelled and, you know, what they did. And all. Like, that's fun for me. I don't necessarily look at it as, like, you know, goal setting or... Um, motivation or anything like that. Like, I really enjoy it. You know, so in that regard, I'm a basketball nerd because I find enjoyment in, in, in learning about players that came before. So I, I don't put too much stock in you know, where I fall or you know, wherever they take place. Kobe, do you ever think about the end? Oh, sure. You've gotten to that point now? Oh, yeah. But when you think about it, what pops into your head? Damn, what am I going to do? <laughs> <laughs> You know what I mean? It's, what the hell am I going to do? Like, really, really, what am I going to do? It's just one of those things that athletes deal with. I think you just, when you get closer and closer to the night at the end of the tunnel, you kind of know. You kind of know. You know that your eye starts squinting because the light gets brighter and brighter. You know what I mean? You just, you just know. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm certainly, it's not around the corner, but it's, it's, it's down the street. 